Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I will be showing you um, some exercises for martial artists. This is my first video of 2018, um, so I'm really excited. I hope this year goes well. I hope you guys tell your friends, um, tell your family, tell everyone you know to subscribe to this channel. This is my first full year of doing YouTube, so um, I have a lot of plans for you guys, uh, so we're going to have so much fun. Okay, so let's get right into the video. The first exercise um, is a simple jumping jack. So when you do this exercise, you want your hands over your head, touching fingertips, and your feet are going to go out, just like this. Um, this exercise is an essential um, exercise for a martial artist because it helps with the with your cardiovascular so if you're ever in a confrontation you can last you won't get um, out of breath or you won't get tired the next exercise um, that's good for martial artists are push-ups so when you're doing a push-up you want your feet together your hands underneath your shoulders and your head is up um, and you just go down, bend those elbows, make sure you're not bending your back or arching, that can really hurt you, you want to do them right so you get the full effect. This exercise um, is good because it works all your whole upper body, your core, your back, your arms, um, which are all involved in the punching process so we do those a lot when we're when we start class and then when we finish class so the next exercise is a crunch or a sit up whichever you want to call it um, but I'm gonna be showing you both right now um, the crunch is a little bit different from a sit up so when you're doing a crunch you want your knees into your body your fingertips on your temples not on your head that will ruin your neck you want them on your temples and you want your shoulder blades to come off the ground and stay off the ground okay and then a sit up you're putting your feet planted on the ground we're putting our we're locking our fingertips together and we're going to the middle to the side or to the other side Okay, that's working. These two exercises are working the whole core. These exercises are good for martial artists because it works the core as you can see from the last clip. Um, the core is what helps you keep your balance in like stances and when you're doing a kick. Okay, the next exercise is mountain climbers. We have two variations of these. So the first one is you're going to bring one knee into your chest. That's going to be your leg that you're going to be switching. So when you do a mountain climber, you want to switch your feet back and forth. Okay, and then we have another variation which we call black belt mountain climbers which are both feet come in and they both go out. This exercise also works the core and your shoulders um, so you're gonna be good at punching and you're gonna have powerful punches. Okay and the last exercise is a burpee. Um, we do them with push-ups some people don't but e either way you they improve your cardiovascular. Burpee, you want to jump up, your hands over your head, come down into a push up, push up, feet back together, and jump back up. Okay, so full um, motion, you're going to jump down, push up, back up. It also works on your um, the push-up areas, the shoulders, 
the triceps, the biceps, the back, the pecs. It works all of those. Last exercise I'm going to show you guys is a leg exercise. A lot of you may know this, but it really helps with the stances portion of karate. So with or any martial arts that you do. So when you do a squat, you want your feet shoulder width apart, your feet facing forward. Um, you don't want your knees to come in. You want them to stay out. You want to keep your back straight and you want to bend down. Okay, so your, um, your legs make a 90 degree angle. You want to keep your back as straight as possible. Okay, those are all the exercises um, that we do in karate or um, that are good for any martial artist um, to get the cardiovascular up, to get or gain muscle. One last thing, um, in, in my martial art, we do not count uh, like the, like, football players or anyone else that counts one two three one one two three two one two three three okay we actually count up so we count one two three four five all the way up to whatever number um, the instructor tells you to do okay guys that's all for today's video um, if you found any of these useful uh, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below if you do karate or any martial art and you have used one of these exercises before. And don't forget to subscribe.